When you first open your account, you might want to check that your levels of leverage are as you would like them. You can do this by going into settings on the bottom left, choosing my accounts and then going to trading options. By clicking on there, you can see the leverage your account is set up for, for all the different types of markets. So for example, if on commodities, you wanted to reduce leverage to 10 to one, it's very easy to do that by choosing it from the drop down box. After you've clicked buy or sell, let's click buy here on the Dow Jones. We have the dealing ticket on the right hand side. There are a few options in here. Obviously you can choose the size of your trade. I'll leave mine to 0.1. It tells you the margin that will be tied up in this trade. In this example, um, about 127 pounds. What I can also do, I can trade just now by click on buy and send the trade through, but I can also choose to buy when the price hits a certain level, either higher or lower than where the market's uh, trading now. So an order that will just sit there. Of course, I can also manage risk as well. So I can choose to have a stop loss attached to my trade. So that can be uh, a normal stop loss or a guaranteed stop. There's a slight premium to pay for guaranteed stops, but it means you'll be out at the level you specify, even if the market moves dramatically. You can have the stop loss placed on a price level. Uh, so if the market hits X level, you're out. A distance away, for example, 100 points away, or an amount of money you're happy to risk losing on the trade. Then finally, we have the close at profit order. If the market hits a certain level of profit, either based on the price you chose, a distance away, or an amount of money uh, you're happy to take as profit. Of course, you don't need to attach any of these and you can just click on buy or sell without using these orders, but it's a way of managing risk and automatically taking profits if you want to.